probably don't understand what I said. We asked for it to be soft boiled, egg hard, or well done steak hard. Because if you're eating a well done steak, come on, bro, you, it's, it's a hard steak. Nobody asked for it to be Rhino Peel at the 7 Eleven or the or the corner spot or Bob Big Chick gas a uh, gas corner door corner store station hard. Nobody asked for that. We wanted it to be soft boiled egg, maybe peanut butter, or well done steak hard. Nobody wanted gas station rhino peel. You took the whole peel and then just chop it up like you're supposed to hard. Nobody asked for that. Guys, it's LJ. Make sure you like the video and subscribe for more great contents for my daddy. Good morning out there, 2K Land, man. Check this out, man. Rough couple of days, man. But full disclosure, listen, we dropped the video last night. Hey, let's get this rep. This is one of the best center bills that you can use to get some rep, man. Hey, we had uh, 2,000 views, 200 some odd likes. Y'all doing really well with the 200 likes uh, within the first 1,500 views. I can't say enough about that. Last couple of videos, 7,000, 4.5. Uh, 5.1, you know what I'm saying? Then, then the, uh, the, what was that? There was the uh, podcast did pretty well, man. So y'all been doing y'all's job, man. I appreciate every single one of y'all for everything that y'all do, man. And because of that, we got to drop y'all here on the Noty Game Wall of Fame, man. When y'all come through and say first, whatever, man, listen, I appreciate that, man. I appreciate that. You know, uh, look, a lot of people we, with the video, you know, a lot of people saying, you know, go with the seven footer and I'm going to tell y'all why we don't go with seven footers because we do a lot of rotating um, if we had a pro-am team perhaps go with a seven footer, but we do a lot of rotating and you're just not going to be fast enough to rotate if you're seven foot. You're going to think you can get there, but you won't. You just won't be athletic enough to get there. You're going to have to sacrifice some other things. Plus, I wanted to be able to shoot the ball so I'm not a liability uh, to my team. So I wanted the 86 midi and the, and the 80 uh, three ball or what have you. Hey, my guy says, hey, this is a great build. I made mine 6'8", but similar. Instead of shooting, I went with the 96 Duncan and really good ball handling. I can run circles around centers and uh, with the 90... With a 90 vertical, I have no issues with rebounding and blocking shots. Might give this build a shot next. We just might do that, man. I ain't gonna lie to y'all, man. We're gonna, we gonna do a lot of builds. We're gonna do just like 2K. We're gonna do some community builds and all this stuff, man. We're gonna get all of this stuff popping because y'all are the guys that make this channel, man. But before we get started, make sure y'all like the video, comment y'all thoughts down below. Y'all know we're going to this thing. To the moon, Alice. Nobody told y'all this today. Y'all my brothers, my sisters, my family. Love each and every last one of y'all. Yes, sir. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, AKA Fresh from the Barbershop, BK of the People's Channel, coming to you live with another video, man. Check this out, bro. I just want y'all to observe something. Can y'all observe this with me? Y'all see I went in there and equipped I took, I look, I had Accelerator equipped. I want y'all to see what happened. Accelerator was equipped. Bow. Come down here. I made a mistake and put on Second Chance. Then I put on the right one, right? I put on Sponge. Accelerator. And y'all probably know about this. Look, it's equipped. So we saw it. That's all I want y'all to see. Y'all probably know about this, man. And y'all probably say it happens all the time. And we got, bro, I did not know this. I'm, I'm not going to lie to y'all, man. I, I don't be knowing about stuff like this. I'm a regular person. Look, still, Accelerator. Bro, I ain't got a lot of y'all, man. A lot of times when I be saying stuff on this game happen and stuff like that, I had some extensive interviews with some ultra casuals that I played with, uh, you know what I'm saying, in, in, the, in the house of the Rams today. We had some good, insightful conversation about the shots and all of that stuff, man. And we're going to talk about all that in one second. But before we get started, make sure y'all like the video, comment y'all thoughts down below, man. We're trying to get the 300 likes. Let's get the 500 likes in the first hour, man. If you just on the video right now, just like that joint right now. I'm trying to see. So I'm trying to see if we can get back over 10k or do or do 2k got us stuck in this uh in in the in the 5k killer area or whatever, man. But anyway, we're gonna start off. I talk, I talked with some guys and we're gonna talk about their thoughts in one second. But the first thing we got, Dime Works says, hey, uh at Baluba, uh, I've been I've been saying this with no bias. I'm saying this with no bias or anger, just an honest opinion. Whatever you did with removing the variable shot timing, roll it back, <laughs> roll it back in the next patch. It actually uh, I actually have no idea what I'm doing now. Uh, I don't know if I'm getting the fast shot or the slow one. I'm just shooting. Regular shooting. I mean, I'm just shooting. Regular shooting. Catch and shoot is fine, but uh, everything else is doomed. And I think uh, one dude said, bro, this stuff is, is this stuff is crazy shooting off the dribble. That's right. And he said, yeah, um, my fading, my fading middies 
uh, are off. It's crazy. So a lot of people say, and then there's this last one I want to show y'all. They said the jump shot is faster in the dominant hand corner and uh, the wing and slower in the opposite side. So I'm going to check that out, man. We're going to see right there. So if I'm in the right corner, I'm right hand, it'll be faster. It'll be slower on the other end. I only really shoot from the left side. So there might be something to that. I'm going to check that out, man. I talked to some guys in the uh, comment, I mean, in the, in, in the house of randoms today. A lot of those guys, ultra casual dudes. I'm asking y'all, y'all got Twitter or whatever? Y'all got that dude say, I got, I, I rock on YouTube a little bit, but I ain't got no Twitter. Cause they would say, I was asking them how the shooting was. And they was like, dang, you shooting it. I, I'm in deeper than the average person, man. I'm out here playing the game 24 hours a day. Not really 24 hours a day. Cause y'all, y'all know I'm working, but y'all know I play this joint way too much and I practice way too much. So of course I'm going to be able to hit shots, but I was interested to see what they say. Everybody in there, it was pretty much a consensus. And one guy went in more into detail. He said, bro, I'm shooting 60% when the game came out. Now I'm down to like 48% or something like that. And that right there should tell you everything that you need to know. I said, well, when did you feel like your shooting fell off? He said, after the first patch. So somebody's on to something. My, my biggest thing is, uh, I think everybody has the same consensus. When the game first came out that very first day, everything was fine there was nothing wrong with it yes people were shooting from hella deep but yo we didn't we didn't care about that like we knew that they could fix that but then when they fixed that they had to test everything else with it though i think the biggest issue is trying to keep the shot percentages down to a realistic thing i don't know if this is a byproduct of crossplay sometimes bro sometimes i feel like i come in the game and i got a completely different jump shot on that's why i deleted all of them because i'm like I, I like you see when i came in here and i got on sponge but i still got on accelerator maybe it's working like sponge but i don't know but i still got on accelerator i feel the same way about the shots maybe it randomly changes you to another shot or something like that i've also said that if you're an off the dribble guy this game is far more difficult for you uh, than than if you are a uh, you know, a person like me who is a catch and shooter. Like most catch and shoot people, we should have no excuse uh, as far as as far as shooting. But we still do because you just never know which shots you're going to get. Like the fella said, he said, "Bro, he dead serious." Said something that my boy T says all the time. He said, "Yo." I feel like my green window is moving. He's like, and not just between games. He's like, one time I'll take a shot in the same game, green window will be at, at X point. The next time it's at Y point, I have no idea what I'm doing out here sometimes. And it's just feel like I'm just guessing or what have you. It's like, again, it don't have no, and he's like, this happened this weekend. And I'm like, see, there you go. He's somebody that don't have uh, Twitter, barely on YouTube, any of that. He said, I just get on, play the game, get off. He don't have a clue why the shooting changed this weekend. But us that's in deep, like, we want to say that, that people are randoms, or like most randoms, or the people that are the people that's in the comment section. There ain't nobody that's in the comment section on Twitter or Reddit a super casual, bro. You're in deep. So we gotta stop counting those guys with the cash. The cash are the people that, that the game is changing around them. They don't have a clue what's going on. And it's just like, bro, what's going on? Like I'm a casual, but like, I'm not super casual. You understand what I'm saying? Cause if I told anybody I was casual, they're gonna be like, bro, there's no way you're casual. And I really don't even play this game two or three hours a day. It is what it is. But y'all understand what I'm saying? Let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. Y'all that in deep or you just semi, we're gonna call us, we're gonna make another, another category for us, semi casual. People that seek out other information about the game but we still just gonna play what's in front of us we really don't care that's what i'm gonna call it semi-casual because i do go on twitter i do do this stuff but I, I promise you if i didn't would i yeah i used to be in gaming forums and stuff like that so it is what it is anyway chuck had a solution for us or had something he says hey psa speed ups and slowdowns are are not a thing the real problem was introduced in in, uh, in 2k's delay uh delay patch 1.3 which is which is known as desync this causes your timing to be randomly subjected to a change that is out of your control. This must be fixed immediately. That's what I'm saying. You just guessing right there. And said, this is the reason why you are shooting poorly and it feels out of your control. Retweet for awareness or whatever. And so more or less what he's showing on these pictures is, you know, he just got, see, he's got a uh, desync player. And then you got, you know what I'm saying? You got that, you got your response time. And then it says sync. And then you got, uh, you got the desync where it's 28, and uh, you know uh what's that a lower response time about the same thing uh let and then what well, latency is uh 26 and then it's, it's adjusted late sync i don't know and that might be why i have not had as many issues as other people because right now i'm playing on power line adapters you plug them into your wall and um it's just like you got an ethernet connection i'm gonna have the guy come and put a drop in here today so i can have my actual ethernet connect I and mean, i can have my actual 
cable modem behind me and we'll see how that goes i'm gonna try to see if i can get them here today but but yeah i'm playing on power line adapter so i probably have a little more latency than the average person and so maybe that's what it is let me see i'm gonna, I'm gonna run a quick ping test real quick if it'll allow me to on my computer we just gonna ping 8.8.8.8 uh normally is 27 milliseconds so i mean i don't have that much latency but there's nothing going across the network right now so um we'll, we'll see how that goes man what do y'all think about that y'all think it's the desync or whatever that could definitely be the case that could be why sometimes you're shooting a basketball and it's like dang um it's like i thought that i i thought i hit it right and i didn't hit it right or whatever but then at the same time y'all ain't got no sympathy for me because in this game i'm shooting the basketball i'm shooting the cover off the basketball so it, I, I i don't know man it is what it is up next we got the czar he came to the community and he said hey the community asked for a skill gap we brought on a high level we brought on high level players to the team for testing and development they help us tune so that shooting is uh is is a challenge but they but they are uh, still successful game comes out and the community wants the shooting to be easier and i'm not gonna lie to y'all man now, i'm gonna say what i said on the podcast and a lot of people probably don't understand what i said we asked for it to be soft boiled egg hard or well done steak hard because if you're eating a well done steak come on bro you it's, it's a hard steak nobody asked for it to be rhino peel at the 7-eleven or the or the corner spot or bob big chick gas a uh, gas corner door corner store station hard nobody asked for that we wanted it to be soft boiled egg maybe peanut butter or well done steak hard nobody wanted gas station rhino peel you took the whole peel and then just chop it up like you're supposed to hard nobody asked for that but hey that's what they gave us man but we already knew this we knew better because anytime you ask 2k for anything it's one extreme or it's the next it's never somewhere amicably adjusted in the middle so hey i just gotta blame us for that man i ain't gonna lie to y'all so the community they says hey i agree but shooting but shooting has changed since the game released and uh that's a problem i agree with that uh let's see what we got stack says there there's little player agency when shooting the uh shooting the ball it's a guessing game <laughs> every time you shoot <laughs> he's not wrong it's a, a lot of times like i said this was a guessing game for me this weekend i'm guessing right but it doesn't mean that it's not a guessing game and it didn't mean that it's not insanely difficult for me because that's exactly what it is right now this the, me shooting the percentages that i'm shooting i'm still shooting well but it is insanely difficult i used to be able to rely on my eyes now i can't even rely on my eyes i can tell what shot catch i was getting it, it, it really just doesn't matter but anyway he says uh the massive input delay mixed with the different game speeds in every mode just makes shooting overall the chore it's really it really has nothing to do with skill i could i could agree with that he says but it stops zens it stops Zen st stacks. That's all that matters. He says, "Snap! I forgot. I forgot. We suffer because 2K is too lazy to implement uh, anti cheat." Hey, I can't get mad at it, man. Hey, Hoodie Boomy says, uh, "Don't think the don't think the majority want it easier, but more uh, consistent." I can see that right there. We just want to be consistent with these catches and stuff. He says, "Right now, the content, the contest system is negative in, negatively impacting shot timing, where you can't, where we can't anticipate if the shot will speed up or slow down. Just a just a defender being in the area without a hand up changes the timing but it is it's not consistently the same outcome example uh speed up of 70 70 percent uh speed up 70 percent of the time the most apparent i mean it's more apparent in the uh competitive spaces pro-am in the stage i'm not seeing the same in park or rec personally i will say that man that's what a lot of people saying they're not saying really the same thing in park or rec i really don't care what they do man just whatever they do just leave it how it is but to me it's just like we understand like as the 2k community we know anytime we ask 2k to do something bro come on man we know what it is bro we know what we're going to get and it's never going to be exactly what you asked for so it, it just is what it is man Zar came back and said just because you don't like the implementation doesn't mean it was not a skill gap perhaps previous two pre, perhaps previous games uh shooting was just too easy now that is a, that is one way to look at it it probably could be that the previous games was uh shooting was too easy and it was uh in, in a lot of cases too easy that's why we asked for whites to stop going in and stuff like that that's cool we I, i'm cool with that but at the same time like i said the, the speed ups and slowdowns and stuff like that those those it's not necessarily that it's not easy or what have you it's just unpredictable like that shot right there i took the shot 
and he, it says 13 percent contested like i'm like okay cool i let it go at the same way but it's contested i'm fine but the only reason that i took the shot is because look when i got the ball look he hits me with it right i'm i'm expecting to to shoot it as soon as i touch it so look he sees the guy going down he even draws him down look at the amount of space i got i'm thinking as soon as this ball touches my hand I'm gonna fire that guy. That's what I do. Y'all know it. Look at this. I get it. I can't shoot the ball. I can't shoot. Now I can shoot it. But look at how long it is before I can shoot it. I'm thinking as soon as it touches my hands, I'm going up and I couldn't do it. Like I'm holding it. It won't allow me to shoot it. That's not a skill gap. That's like, bro, what is this? I can't shoot the ball. It is what it is. Like that's that's what we're trying to understand them to, to get to, get them to understand is that that it's not necessarily the the that is hard or anything. It's just that this is something fundamentally flawed within the game, and it's more amplified the higher the more you go up the skill level tier. So as as somebody in the in the wreck, I'm I'm right here in in wreck. It's not that bad. Um, it's doable in in regular park in the theater and it's doable in the wreck but once you exceed these levels it's it's amplified more and more and i think it, it it's it's more and more amplified the fact when you're when you're dribbling the ball and when you're moving or something like that but anyway uh chalk comes back and he says rng shot speed timing is not equal to a skill gap i agree with that uh this the real skill comes from getting open and timing the shot perfectly not guessing whether or not we will get a normal one and that's really what it is like right now you didn't even have to guess before and like i said they can leave it how it is i will figure it out i will adjust i felt that way the first three times so now that i'm semi impacted i gotta feel the same way just leave it alone stop messing with it or roll it back to what it was before and we can we, we gonna figure it out baby like i made a new dude last night and i'm shot i shot 12 or 12 in that game bro obviously i understand how to shoot and i understand the shooting system but why learn this just for y'all to change it again like is that part of the skill gap who can adapt the quickest i don't i don't know man hey but anyway hey kanye says the question that the question that you dare's gotta should be asking yourself is which part of the community is is uh asking for the skill gap that's the comp community uh why would you change the already challenging enough shooting from which from uh from which you had day one that's true as well are there more casuals than high level players in the game absolutely drop the mic on that man like i said man we gotta play the game gotta be made for casuals because it's way more casual players that's really why you're seeing them trying to figure out a change and stuff like that because anytime you try to cater to the competitive community that you're gonna get disappointed man it's gonna happen every time it happened with call of duty it happened with my like my boy uh ramp say with destiny these games were not in if a game was not initially created to be a competitive game it is hard as the dickens to turn that lever toward there and like you're gonna get people like me uh me and my semi-casual people that we just want to play the game and just get on and have some fun yes i will put in a little work so i will be better than the average person but i don't want it to be impossible that's all i'm saying just don't make it impossible that's all we saying. we're willing to put in some work but dang like when you see when you see what's going on it's hard to ignore and like i said i want to be the voice of the people of the randoms of all of that and if they're saying that it's too hard and like they were good until things change and things keep changing and they don't know why they're changing and stuff like that then like i said they gotta have a voice too man it sucks but it is what it is up next tj said hey man i'm done with this game i got kicked out of <laughs> i got kicked out and then and just uh just like that i'm out of the top 10. That's tough stats, I'm not gonna lie. Last but not least, that boy Fracito says, hey, look, man, this is crazy right here. I think he got 30 in this joint or something like that. He said, Tacino will wager post hooking in uh in three hours for three grand. Uh, uh three grand is six six thousand pot. Then he came back and said, Yeah, I'm never wagering a post score again. Most broke, most broken they been in 2K history. Miss me with that. I ain't gonna lie to y'all, man. I wouldn't have played him in the first place, but hey. I see no play most hooking every year. We already know what it is, man. But y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. Do they need to change shooting? Is it fine where it is? Or do they just need to stop? Just whatever they do it. Leave it where it is. We'll figure it out. Just stop. Please stop. You know what I'm saying? Like, what do y'all think, man? Or do they need to adjust it? Or should they just do what they said and just change it back to the normal? I need to know what y'all think so we can try to get this to the devs and let them know, man, because I'm going to be the voice of the people. And, uh... I'm listening to y'all, man. I want y'all to know y'all got a voice with your boy.
Let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. I'm gonna holler at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK of the People's Champ. And I say I'm having issues shooting in a video that I shot 71%. So, like I said, I'm in deeper than most, though. Gosh, please. Gosh, please.